Now let us study the housing for sheep. Goats like to stay at heights above the ground, but the sheep is happy on the ground itself. A shed is necessary to shelter the sheep during rain and in night hours. Go for low cost or systematic high cost shed depending upon the investment capacity. This farmer has converted the silkworm rearing house into a sheep shed. But this farmer has constructed the ideal sheep shed separately. Cross ventilation and light penetration is most important in the sheep shed. Open paddock next to the shed like this is necessary. Keeping the sheep here at least for a few hours daily is a must. In this farm, feed and fodder are given here itself. Sheep are kept inside the shed only during night hours. Here the shed is of an open type and the sheep spend more time inside the shed. It is fed here itself. Concentrates and water are given in the paddock. Technically both these methods are acceptable. Each adult sheep needs 10 square feet area. Shed and the paddock together are covered by wire mesh fence of enough height. Trees around the farm keep the atmosphere cool. Pregnant eaves, lambs and rams are kept in separate groups based on sex, age and body weight. This is necessary to provide feed fodder and medicine in the required quantity and on time. Bamboo or wire mesh partitions are made for this purpose. Mud flow is better. It absorbs the urine, minimizing ammonia smell. This is important for good health of the sheep. Here the burnt mud bricks are used for flooring for easy maintenance. But cement floor is not advisable. Sheep regularly lying on cement floors get bed sores. Distributing the feed and fodder in this big herd is a big task. Feeders on this kind are useful. It may be of wood or metal sheet. One feeder for 15 to 20 sheep is necessary to avoid competition. This type of water troughs of GI sheet are kept for drinking water. Plastic coated metal troughs are still better. Clean the feeders and water troughs once in a day. Motor and manual shaft cutters are the other necessary equipments.